Uh, yeah, exactly. We're <laughs> we're going real crazy, and I have to go to work after this. Thanks a lot. Oh, okay. <laughs> I got three hours. I'm sure it'll wear off by then, right? Oh, yeah. The Brad Gorko. All right. Well, uh, on commentary, good setup we got. here. I'm McDoppel. I already introduced myself back when I started with your guys' match, but yeah. Oh, I mean, new match, right? Mm. For the vods. Seated ten right now in our uh, in this tournament, anyway. So I think yeah, I did pretty 10. good. Let's I go. think I got because one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I think I got like tied for sixth. Sixth or seventh? I believe you're tied for seventh, so nice. you're uh, on the same wavelength as the issue. Hey, man, I beat Nash first match, 2 0. <laughs> that makes me happy. Alright, Brad sticking out the uh, Samus. Mm -hmm. Does not want to go uh, Snake. Gorkin. Gorko having a lot more luck with his uh, Captain Falcon combos against Brad here than he had against you. <laughs> uh, he just feared DK. That's it. Ooh, I went, a I nice stage spike. Buffered the air dodge. I even took back up. No, uh, ooh, 11% on that. Ooh, and a meaty charge shot. A quick 50% for Gorko here. Brad, when Brad's on with his Samus, it is it's pretty mean. Samus, uh, Samus is a really unique character. Mm -hmm. I really like her. She can really be played any way, too. Like, you can mm. sit back and zone the whole game. You can get in up close with her uh, aerials and her tilts. One thing I miss is uh, we get dash attack and up B at 0% when you have rage. Oh yeah? Smash 4. It insta kills. <laughs> nice! Yeah. That would have been amazing. I've gotten it I've gotten it a whopping twice in my entirety of I imagine it. it's, it's hard to do. It's just gimmicky. How much rage do you have to have for that? Uh, I think max or near max. Jeez. Yeah, it's super gimmicky. A much more even second stock than in the first. Brian, you must be everything's packed up up there. Next time. Next time, we gotta play some Central Fiction. Yeah. A good back air from Gorko to finish off that second stock. Brad trying to answer back quickly to keep this as even as possible. Alright, nice fairy to forward to. Ooh, he tried it. No rock rock attempt. All right, 48% uh, on Brad here. He needs mm -hmm. to uh, clutch this stock out soon. Gorko doing a good job of surviving at the high percentage. Ooh, Ooh near one a meaty down air. spike. The, that's a really good confirm. Mm -hmm. A good first game there. I wish I had an attack into spike. I mean, Ganon hits so hard, all of his attacks could be attack into spike. <laughs> I have, I have. You just got to time it right. I have combos into everything, though. Yeah. Let me just pull out the flow chart here for your Greninja. Yeah, let me just pull out the down tilt. <laughs> let me pull out the down tilt chart. Let's see what we got. <laughs> Combos out of down tilt. They go on for days. I got percentages. I got everything. <laughs> but uh, Gorkman taking the first game uh, kind of significantly. I wonder if Brad's going to switch up. He's played Snake against my Gor uh, Ganon. But he seems to be sticking with the... Through and Samus through, though, here. I think he's a zoner player. He's going to switch it to Dark Samus over Samus. See what Gorkman is. Gorkman's going to stay? Is he going to stay? Is I think his again? Snake is better than his Samus, personally. Oh, they're both sticking it out with their mm -hmm. same characters. Mm -hmm. They're saying, we'll just run it back. This is Brad's tournament uh, tournament uh, match. Yeah. There's a CB. Clutches this one out and gives to a game three situation. Or if he's just going to fall Good right bait into that him. front air. A good start from Brad. This is what he wants if he wants to win this second game. Yeah, he needs, to, he needs to do his best to keep uh, Falcon out. So Falcon really trying speed. to keep that quick character at a distance. Yeah, Falcon speed is uh, one to behold. He can just kind of be where he needs to be. Good spacing there from Gorko to make sure he's avoiding that forward air and close enough to grab that grab. That was a good tether to the stage, too. Alright, read the roll, but... Uh, and the spot dodge. Oh. A good attacks, combo from Gorko. No finisher on it. Again Ooh. with that uh, hit to hit to downer. Falcon uh, really showing off what Falcon can do. And yet he complains every day. Falcon is bad. He even has a uh, even has a, a Discord <laughs> dedicated to how bad Falcon is. Yeah, he does. But he's proven Falcon's pretty good when he's playing on fleek, though. Mm -hmm. uh, I lost a few IQ points for saying on fleek. Why? I don't know why you did. I don't know why either. We're too old for talk like that, you and me. 
definitely. I'm too old to be here. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't we all? Touché. Except for maybe like three of us. Good forward air. Oh, the get up attack. All right, 72% already on Brad. Uh, let's keep this game relatively close. Ooh, the regrab and no punish. Ooh, mm. good raptor boost there. Red wall jump over on this. Ooh. Ooh, problem kick clashing with the, uh, the side beat. Not like uh, Ganon's Warlock kick, which will just eat him and keep going. Yeah. A good, hey, a good use of that uh, down B there to avoid the Falcon kick. At least stalled him in midair. And if you notice there, uh, Brad did a down throw and he jumped and waited for an aggressive option, mm -hmm. which Gork actually just fit through. Brad's really, uh, really doing good with this. Uh, he is. I'm really hoping this goes to a third game. This definitely. is a good matchup here. I Both mean, probably, of them not for, are probably not for Falcon. Well, yeah. I meant a matchup between the players, not oh, so much the characters. Definitely. But, uh, but yeah. <laughs> it's always fun seeing these two interact with each other. Rapid Jab not killing like it did in Smash 4. A good job from Brad to uh, to keep his air movement out there to make yeah. uh, Falcon really go deep for it. Down tilt. Around. All, right, all comes down to this last stock. Brad, I'm sure, is really feeling the, uh, the pressure here. Definitely. But he, if he keeps his composure and keeps his wall up, he's really looking for this offstage spike. He's really good when he is offstage at, at uh, punishing the Falcon up B with his own up B. Come close to the stage there. Definitely. Good up yeah, uh, anti air option. Mm -hmm. Of course, with the latest patch, you really want to be able to hit the, the full up B to get the full effect now. It happens. Sometimes moves don't work out properly. Just something you gotta deal with. What Ooh, a good Raptor boost. Chasing Raptor boost always now. tricks me. It always reaches farther than I think it's going to. Yeah, but. That's also its burden because sometimes it won't fully connect because of that. Mm -hmm. So you're pulling kind of. Ooh, nice wave dash into the uh, down B. Not sure how Brad managed to avoid that uh, up B at the end of that combo, but uh, he must be breathing a sigh of relief here. Definitely is. Oh, Ooh, a smart play to grab him and not go for anything else. Definitely. He's at 157 and he wants to me. Brad really wants to get this kill and force this to a third game. And we're going to see... Ooh, new to be the Good grab. down throw. Good tech, no, tick throw. 173. Brad has not been touched. Oh, there it is. Up B. The full combo up B. Kept his distance and uh, it paid off. Brad kept... Uh, kept his, Yeah. Kept from getting hit for the whole last like 30 seconds of that match. It was very, very impressive. I feel like he definitely needed the uh, mobility that Samus had more over mm -hmm. than Snake. Lua, Lua says, let's go, Brad. Oh, hey, Brad, Lua's cheering for you in chat. He says thank you. This does not have any uh, armor. Why isn't Lua here? Or Dark Elf? He's like, he's on the island or something. Oh. All the islands. The entire, the entire, <laughs> the entire continent's an island. Every island. <laughs> oh, shit, bro, you right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shoot, I swore. Ah, frick. Man, we're gonna get uh, banned off Twitch. Sorry, guys. Heck. Well, might as well say the N-word Yeah, <laughs> might as well just real go at it. <laughs> <laughs> Game three is uh, going to Gorkman's counter pick here. Mm -hmm. Yoshi's story is a little dangerous because uh, those little cardboard bits on the end can really get a weird stage spikes if you get a, a good up hit near them. Definitely. I've, di I've, taken a, I've taken a set off of Barnett specifically because of the uh, way the sides interact. Mm -hmm. I should come to this stage more often. I don't generally like this stage. Uh, it's good not, for not so much when I'm Ganon, but when I'm me Brawler. Because the up B, when I'm trying to do it on the uh, on the ledge to do the spike, I always get stopped by the, the ledge up top, cause it, or oh, the yeah. platform up top, because it stretches out. Yeah. It's a little, it's much a, it's harder a little to do. Risky. Ooh, and a nice after jump on the platform. Mm -hmm. So Brad, this is a lot keeping the momentum from the end of the last game here. This is a lot more of a Falcon favored map than it is. Uh, sorry, it's a lot more Falcon favored stage. Yeah. <laughs> Not map. Map stage. We all know what you meant. Definitely. Brad, though, really showing us why he's uh, the best Samus probably. At I feel like this. he's the only Samus here. <laughs> That's then, why he's the best. And again, he is the best because of it. Actually, Samus did him. Let's see how that goes. 
Ooh, that was close. Ordered. Not Nearly quite. It. Trying to eat him on the side there. Half tilt. Not quite doing it. Ooh, just missed it with that down tilt. Oh, got clipped with the inside hit it up there. A good high finish from Brad. Spike not quite doing it, but he's in kill throw percentage up and up there. Oh. Back throw. Oh, it didn't do anything with the throw. Just decided to pummel and get that damage. Yeah, I decided to read what option he had. Good down smash. All right, Raptor boost to start off this combo. Falcon. Falcon, you hit the Raptor boost, sometimes you can just Ooh, spin the control. Good stick. up smash from Brad. Those multi hits are real hard to dodge sometimes. Definitely. You think you've dodged, you think you've dodged them all, but the last time. One more, one more comes yeah. out. Especially bad. Brad, when keeping when Gorko at a distance here, trying to really use the best of, of Samus's kit. Ooh, another knee. Oh, a good spike reversal, reversal from Brad, leaving him at a stock advantage. Although at 86%, that could go away real fast. Maybe. I'm still in bracket. It's true. <laughs> hey, you're still in bracket. Really trying to, to break Gorko's shield there with the uh, the rockets. <laughs> Charge shot combo. All right, 125 on Brad. Needs to uh, keep his composure and keep this distance. Ooh, oh, a no. good back air from Gorko back air. to finish that second stock. This is the last stock you'll be seeing. This is it. Two. This is a good close match from these two guys. Somebody's, Both very uh, good competitors. Definitely. Somebody's losing this match. Ooh, a good catch on that forward air. Doesn't quite get the spike on his down air. All right, good down beast placement. Reading a lot of what Gorko's doing. Brad is seeing into the code, as some would say. He's just placing these uh, placing these attacks well and reading the option afterwards. Ooh, Ooh, a nice good grab, grab. corner. Ooh, Doesn't quite land that forward air, which might have finished it at 93%. More than likely, I didn't think he had a didn't think he had another stock. Oh, Nair won to fair though. That was a super close game. Good match from all of these guys. Money on Brad, you lost. <laughs> Lua says, "Yeah, I'm on the island. The moon won. I'll jump down. Let's go." Well, Darkel, you owe money. Darkel, Lua. <laughs>